if being a mechanic's taught me anything, it's that having the right tool can make all the difference between making money and losing money. It can also make all the difference in how your day goes. If you're gonna have a day with broken knuckles and just be mad as hell, or if you're gonna be happy and feeling like you're king of the world. Um, one of the tools that can really help you feel that way if you're doing timing belts on Subarus, especially the EJ205, uh, that's what you find in the XT turbos and also in the uh, STIs. The fun ones, the ones that you want to be doing stuff with, is uh, this cam holder tool. Now, anybody that's done a uh, timing belt on one of these knows, any dual overhead cam Subaru, uh, the cams want to rotate because of the spring pressure that's on them from the, uh, the valve springs. Now, when you're doing the timing belt, the last thing you want to do is have these cams move or do something crazy because the timing belt's off and your valves can hit. Um, there's special instructions um, that show you how to rotate the, the cam so that you don't damage the valves, but it's scary, it's freaky. There's lots of different tools that you can use to hold cams. Everybody knows that. A lot of them are expensive. Some of them are hard to find. Most of them you have to order in from a catalog or get off the tool truck and pay through the nose on credit. Well, I've got great news for you. I'm going to do a review on this tool here, this cam lock tool from Company 23. You can see that there's an offset spacer that you can use to change it um, to be deep or not and uh, it's curved so right between you don't imagine the bolts for the cams right between you've got timing marks here and then you've got timing marks here and then one out to the side so this allows you to be able to see all the timing marks it's got I can't say it's it, this is what kind of magnets in it <laughs> go ahead and pronounce that the best you can ne neodymium or something I shouldn't even try but these really super powerful magnets are in there and they hold it securely into the allen head of the bolt so that it doesn't go anywhere. You don't want this popping off, falling out or something and having it move. So the way this tool is used is you get all your timing covers torn down and uh, you put this into place and then you tighten it into place so that it holds. You can see that this is a uh, 19 millimeter and this is a 17. These are easy sizes. You know, I like working on BMWs. BMWs are a great car, but what the heck is up with all the 16 millimeter bull crap and 15 mil I mean you work on a Toyota or any of these Japanese cars are funner to work on because it's easier to guess what the bolt size is going to be and you know same goes with this you know 19 millimeter and 17 you use those all the time so it's super convenient super thoughtful uh, super secure you know which is an important thing I've just really been taken by this I mean they're made in the USA Am I patriotic or am I patriotic? I mean, not just anywhere in the USA. They're made right smack dab in the middle of Wisconsin off of Interstate 39 in Rothschild. You know, you look all over the shop, you see flags. You know, I, I, how much of this country is going to be outsourced to China? And, you know, nothing against China except for they're polluting the crap out of the planet and a lot of the stuff that you get from China's crap now. It's frustrating. It's really, I mean, why don't you buy all your tools at Harbor Freight? The reason why is because you have to use a warranty. This has a lifetime warranty and you're not even going to need it. You know, that's why it's an easy decision for Company 23 to do a lifetime warranty. This thing is beefy. It's tough. The construction is excellent. I mean, you're not going to have to do anything with that. I mean, it's built right to begin with. I mean, the last thing you want to do is get into a job and have something like this fail. Um, so it's built right. I've tested it. I've used it myself and I strongly endorse it. Um, the best part about this is that you don't have to put it on credit to buy it. That's right. It's not expensive. It's about 50 bucks. So the other thing is that it's small. I mean, it doesn't stick out clear off the cams like a big handled uh, keyed up tool does. Uh, you know, and you, you can use those. I have those. But this is so small and easy, the belt goes around it, no problem. So, do I love it? I love it. I'm going to do you a favor and put a link in the description for Company 23's website. Uh, here's a little tour of it. Uh, you go to products and they make it really easy. They divide it by the make. Um, now these guys, they're not like Sears. They don't take a tool kit or a tool idea and throw in there all the crap that everybody doesn't want to make a bajillion piece set just to get rid of stuff. These guys are here to help you out. They make it easy. I mean, you can go right to what you want. You want Subaru tools? You got Subaru tools. You want a cam lock tool? Bam! It's right there. I love their website. It's awesome. And they're funny too. I mean, these guys, 
there, it's engineers and technicians like you and me that have experience, that know what they want. I mean, these are guys that want to get the job done. That's all there is to it. Not only do they want to get the job done, they want to help you to get the job done. Uh, you have downloadable instructions that will show you how to do a timing belt job. All that legal crap doesn't scare them. They give you the instructions anyway. That's what I'm trying to tell you. So, they tell you how to put the tool on. They tell you how to tighten it properly. They tell you how to take the timing belt off. They tell you how to compress your tensioner. Here you got an Allen key. I like to use a drill bit. Drill bits are usually a little bit more uh, hard and the sizes are easy to find. But anyway, helpful information. They give you the torque specs. I mean, they give you everything you could ever want. You know, as good information and better illustrations than you find in a lot of the automotive subscription stuff that you have to pay for as a mechanic. I mean, who does this stuff? Seriously. These guys are here to help you and they have tech support. I email with them and they respond to your emails. They're awesome.